So how are you liking this new job? It's really nice, so all okay. I do is just do social media. <laughs> that one you already have lockdown now. Yes, now I told you to join Snapchat. You that likes to talk can give them self righteous to you. What's that supposed to mean? Well, they don't want to ask us if you don't see now. Shalom, I'm not in your mood, I beg. Meanwhile, I'm talking to me now, or you're still doing shakara for him. I was never doing shakara. See, wow, you wanted to beg me. No. So then, what do you want? I don't know. I just feel some type of way. I don't like the fact that he was locking lips to somebody else. I don't know. Sure, you know what you're doing. Go. You don't extend this in so much like this. You don't. I don't think it's safe to like. You know, I'm trying to get into that. To so what? Who advice me thing? But he was locking lips. No, no. Oh. Ah, Auntie Tiwa. Mm -hmm. Auntie Shalewa. Yeah. Mommy is calling you. Say make a call greet her friend. We just come. Who is it? I don't know her mom. She never come here before. Eh, be like say they sabi long because if you see as they hug, hmm. She can't bring her fine son. Hmm. Yeah, they look the boy they smile. What kind of mess is this now? Ah, how can I come out of the kitchen looking like I see if I slept inside? You know what? Tiwa, let's go. I'm not going anywhere. I'll do it to them. Why? Okay. Because you're wearing your nightie. Mm. When you're dressed, is there anything different from what you're wearing? I, I beg, let's slap go. you. Oh, I beg, save the aggression. Let's go. <laughs> Good morning, Ma. Good morning, Ma. Ah, Mrs. Pedro, good morning. Good <laughs> morning, dear. How are you? Fine, thank you. Good. Nathan. Wow. Look at me thinking you weren't going to recognize me. Why won't I? Won't you greet the mother too? Sorry, Ma. Good morning, Ma. Good morning. How have dear. you been? I'm very well, my dear. <laughs> now that you see your friend, I have become so small, Abby. Have I no, Ma? I was just, I was surprised, that's all. <laughs> Nathan, you're looking so different, so look at you looking like you just stepped out of GQ. Well, I had to make up for this not so nice face. True. Don't be rude. <laughs> well, we all used to it. Ah, is this the Ashwabi for Veronica's wedding? Who told you to look inside? Monwe, my philomindasi. Now, wow, plot that we will still see. When it's time to so style, don't call me. Nigbati, you're right to be out here. Ah, be already. You better come and start to go to your office before they sack you. Whoa, hmm, eh. Kobo, I will not give you. Shobo, sure. So when did you get back? A few weeks ago. You didn't think to give us a shout? I didn't know where you lived. Mm. I don't have your number. In fact, as mommy said that she was coming here, I just offered to drive. I could have asked your sister now. She'd have gotten it from Shalewa. So Shalewa is on her train, right? I didn't know that. I've been listening to your radio show. Oh. Good job. You finally put all your opinions to good use. So they were useless before? Uh, more like wasted. Well, so what have you been up to since you got back? Well, a friend of the family is helping me get a job like this. Wow. Yes. Where do I start from with Nathan? We went to primary school together, secondary school. Eventually, our families became friends. He's not always been the most good looking guy, but he's a very sweet guy. But this new Nathan. <sighs> Looking all fresh, well put together, dripping swag. I'm sure he must have a babe somewhere. He was probably holding him. But anyways. So Nathan, are you seeing someone or do you still have a crush on Tiwa? Coming to think about it, he always did have a thing for me. Well, so I thought. Well. Well what? She's single and there's nobody and my mom needs her to get married like ASAP. So do the needful. Hmm. You better start going to work before I beat you up. <laughs> Sorry, yo. I was just trying to help. Mm. Bye. So, single, huh? Crush, huh? Oh, please. <laughs> it's obvious that I had a crush. I was way too prophetic to be subtle. To be fair, he was. It was so obvious. But I was too busy making sure all the good looking guys were looking at me. You know now. Why so single? 
too many heartbreaks right now. I'm just off the dating thing. Just taking a chair. Well, yeah, it's part of life. I suppose so. You? Yes, I'm single. <laughs> but my mom is trying to shop me to every single daughter of someone she knows. So what? No one's suitable yet? No, not yet. But I'm going to find someone who's going to make me happy, hopefully. Amen. That is the plan. So, you've got to show me around Lagos. You know, <laughs> I've not been here for, like, years. Definitely. Don't worry about it. We'll plan something soon. Do you know what's so funny? Oh, baby. I love me. Look at this woman. I know what they're up to. But at least Mama Tiwa should have given me a heads up first now. At least I'd have taken a shower or something. I love me, Letty Girl. We're talking about unspoken rules, especially when it concerns relationship. You know that rule that says never put all your eggs in one basket? Well, my understanding of this is if you don't put all your eggs in one basket, where do you put them? You know how people say wait until you're in a relationship with someone and they tell you exclusively that you're dating. But if they never exclusively tell you, what do you do? Do you just keep waiting? Or do you date other people while hoping they exclusively let you know? Call in and let me know what you think. The gist with Tiwa. <laughs> Madam Basket, hmm? are you trying to get Midi's attention because he's leaving today? Is he? Yes, he is. And the new GM is even downstairs, Seth. Try. I still can't believe he's leaving. <laughs> I can't believe that things went from fairy tale to bitter leaf soup with both of you, and it's all on you. I don't understand. Was I the one who told him to go and kiss his ex fiance No, but you turned him down, so you have no right to dictate who he kisses. Fair enough, but he can do way better than that annoying dude. <laughs> well, at least he ah. did not pick Hadiza. Yeah. That would have been the worst. Oh my gosh, I cannot <laughs> imagine what would have happened if he had <laughs> Oh my goodness. Mm. What was so funny? I must say, you are a true daughter of your father. What's up? I think I might have to add a few things to the list of don'ts I sensed previously. OAP should not be seen in the studio before and after their session, and they should definitely not be seen gossiping, as there's a lot of work to be done. Madam, temporary aid. Why don't you just focus on the job and tasks that they gave to you, instead of you going about chot, 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 like machine gun? Don't be mad, because nobody sees you as a good enough head for anything. Always remember, one head is better than half. <laughs> You that took the job so that you can be having meetings with your imaginary husband. <laughs> I really should interrupt them, but Disney needs to put this girl in her place. Always going around talking anyhow. Don't confuse me for Tewa, please. What? Oh, please. Everybody knows that you quit because you told me that you love him and he turned you down. Excuse you. How embarrassing. I'm sure you're the reason he's leaving. Auntie Adiza. I'm sure you're the only person who thinks like this, which is fine. But I also know that you're very, very upset because he gave me more attention than he did you. You know what you need to do? Just focus on your temporary job. Sweetheart, unlike you, he was the one asking and I was the one saying no. <laughs> Auntie Hadiza, you that come on good morning, they greeted you. You started planning a wedding and picking a shape. Mm -hmm. My goodness, your desperation is so amazing. You see, it's a pity that our new GM is a woman. Please, oh, don't go and start hitting on her, making passes at her. Because if you do, little piece of advice, I will personally report you to the police. 14 years in prison <laughs> for you. Funny. Oh, by the way, Tiwa, the new GM actually asked me to bring you downstairs, but I say you're too busy gossiping. I'll let her know you'll come when you're done, eh? Someone needs to get me a lawyer real, real quick. Because I'm about to commit murder. I will kill this girl. Hey, Tiwa. Tiwa, I have told you time and time again to allow me to handle this girl. But no, you'll be doing good, Samarita. Didi. Her time is coming. Kai. It's coming. So, I will be Nana. Well, we'll take it up from there. Just let me know if you need any assistance. and then. We'll... Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon to you, too. It's so kind of you to grace us with your presence. I'm, I'm sorry, Ma. I wasn't aware of... <sighs> I'm Kate Amadi, your new general manager. And I was just discussing with Midday now, and he was explaining to me that you've quit as head of programs because you felt it was too much for you. 
No, ma, I was interfering with... The, the best OAPs know how to juggle. And you're supposed to be highly ranked. I didn't see you as a quitter. Ma, I'm not a quitter. Excuses? Just... Thank God for Hadiza. She's picking up your slack and managing her own responsibilities perfectly. You will officially hand over to her. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm being attacked? And this little rat is here to watch it all. I believe Tiwa should also be willing to share the idea she might have had for the station. After all, we are one company. Instead of you to say that you want to use my ideas to shine. That's not it. Hadiza is simply thinking in the best interest of this station. You see, in life, there are thinkers and there are doers. There are people who have ideas and people who implement them. You are a thinker. Hadiza brings your ideas to life. I'll be expecting your official handover before noon tomorrow. Hadiza, please show me around. Certainly, Ma. It's no fun not to be a teacher's pet, huh? Who was the teacher's pet? You were kind of man. So what am I poppy now? You see, this is your attitude and your smart mouth, eh? Let me see you use it with Kate. You're not my boss anymore. <laughs> you made sure of that from day one, Tiwaladi. So what, you're going to blame you quitting on me too? Anyways, don't be rude. Uh, be respectful and don't forget everything we've tried to work on as regards your show. I mean, it is getting uh, much higher ratings now. You know you don't have to leave. My father owns this station. I'm sort of part of you guys. Mm -hmm. See what? All you have to do was just say yes. I don't regret saying no. I did the right decision for myself. Imagine if I had said yes, and then a few weeks later I'd have found you shoving your tongue down someone else's mouth. Well, better my fiancé than uh, uh, someone new. <laughs> So she's your fiance again? My, my ex, I meant. Of course she is. Anyways, to Aladi, just work hard. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma. Goodbye, Nidhi. Goodbye, Tiwa. Tiwa! Shaliba, what is it? Please, I'm tired. I'm not in the mood. Ah. Remember that guy I told you about that works in my office? See, if there's any guy that works in your office, it's bad news. I don't want to hear. Just because your own love life has been tired doesn't mean that mine has, has as well. Please let me be happy and listen to what I have to say. So, we went to the canteen today. And as we're eating lunch, she kept on talking and talking and talking. And then he asked for my number. Although he said it's for work purposes, but I know he feels the exact same way about me. Mm -hmm. Like God, like he's so calm. God, he's so hot. If we get married. Ah, I reject it for you. Eh? I reject if la yela bara Jesu. Ah, motaka if da no shifu a weni mimi. Ah. Oh, when it comes, it will be forever and forever. Uh -huh. I found my husband. Huh? Ah. Ah. <laughs> amen, amen. Blessings and glory. Ah, we cause thanksgiving mm -hmm. and honor. Mm -hmm. eh? Power and might belong to the Father forever and ever. Amen. Ah! When did you meet him? Has he asked you to come and get dinner? He works in my office now. Ah. Number one. And the most important question. Is he married? Abio, you feel like I'm being prophetess that will come and cast spell on us. Can I talk? Can I talk? Please, can I just talk? He's not married, though. Uh-uh. Eh, my dad, be my boy. She's right now. Exactly. Ah, she's right, though. Ah, Tori. But I can see you're happy and uh, 
you are growing. <laughs> ah, Oluwa, Osheo, I know that very soon. <laughs> he will uh, bring his parents, yes. and then I will start to sell uh, a <laughs> peach. Oh, peach. <laughs> no, I don't want peach. I want olive green or sage green. A <laughs> water, the olive green and sage green. Safe, no. Dangerous. Whoa. Hey, Sage. look. My friends will wear the color that I pick. Let your friends wear their own. Ah, this one. It's not my wedding. I'm allowed to pick the color I want to pick. By the way, peach is not in vogue anymore. <sighs> Let me tell you. Anything that I your mother wears is in vogue. Whoa. Hey! When I wear that peach, bye. Mm. Mm? Mm. And put diamond. Mm. Ah, I will come and be shiny. I will be signing, and then my gele will just be like this, then your song. Mama Ooh. sign, mama sign, mama sign. Sign, sign like that, man. I will almost be an alarm. Mama, see what for the man then. Even here, oh. Ah, hey, 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 hey. Ma? do. Ha. Who call you? I'm mom in a unit. Oh, damn. Ah. Go and tell the spirits that follow you. Can she know let me show you? Ah ah. Me I no follow. Ah! Did you see that lucky thing he buy? Mm hmm. Ada ada. Oshisko PLC. Talon gemuta jandu. Hello. Why is Nadine calling me? How you throw your diet away, ke? Oh, the Kobe skitty. Oh, cause I don't get home, 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 home. Tiwa, Shepi, you have just finished eating pounded yam to your long warm way. Shalewa, ah, Shalewa, ah, Shalewa, ah. Kilo Shale, Shale, what happened? Come on, mio, mommy, careful, mommy, careful, mommy, careful. Shalewa, Shalewa, ah, eh, mio, ah, what happened? 